I drove away from the Floridias last year thinking that I hope I draw it one more time in my lifetime and months later I get to return. It's pretty nuts. The goal is one Ibex in my life. If we're successful, I won't put in again. We're in Hatch, New Mexico. The Garden of Eden when it comes to green chilies. So we're gonna pick up maybe 30 pounds of them and pretty much make them in every meal we possibly can. They're that good. Pain train awaits. <laughs> Sound? We gotta fix that buck. You get that by school? I'm gonna put that a little bit on the rest and get it real quiet. I don't hear anything. My one request this year was to have shade. I did some research on the internets and came up with a simple umbrella that will attach to a chair. There's no way you're gonna last in the seat all day without the shade. We spotted them. First ones of this trip. They're smaller than you think they are. They're so small. I mean, they're just tiny out there. So this is creamy garlic, furby chicken with mushrooms, rice, a small little salad. We're gonna hunt our ass off. It's just that we're gonna eat really well while we hunt really hard. Look how well he looks like a stick. I mean, it's perfect, right? After 19 days of grinding it out, you drive away from those mountains, looking over your shoulder, staring at him. Just, I'll never, I never forget driving through, looking through the windows, like looking over Buck's head, looking through the windows, trying to get one last look at the Floridas before, I don't know when the next time in my life I'll be able to come down. And then to draw it again, man, to be successful on this hunt means a lot more than anything ever has because I don't know if I've ever tried this hard to be successful at maybe anything in my life. Last year it came down to archery and I want to make sure this year that is not the problem. The first arrow is the last arrow. When I draw my bow back, this hunt's going to be over. Starry eyes and cellophane, she takes her walk, she makes her plan. Truck bails down the avenue. This is pretty traditional for our Ibex hunt last year. Buck signs up for a bare butt spanking. <laughs> and that's basically what's gonna go on. Not this time. School's in session. Gonna pull out a win. It's not the hiking this time, it's the heat. Gotta be close to 90 degrees out. It's brutal, man. Steven and I have 12 liters of water with us, and I don't think there will be an ounce left when we get to the bottom. Buck's down there, he's got billies kind of working their way downhill. We're gonna mark him with the handkerchiefs, and then we're gonna sit and wait. I think we're gonna do great. That's him. That's our boy. Not that one, not that one, not that one, not that one, not that one. His little sister on his own he brushed her hair and watched her grow Maybe I was wrong Some downtime, pull the cactus out of my right leg and Then I'll get the stuff on the left As I've heard, that just got bumped We've been watching them all day 2,000 yards out, but coming kind of eagerly in this way So we might be making night moves here real soon your side or the bridge. Thank <laughs> you. 
Look, we got a dead Ibex, buddy. He's done. He's done. We did it, man. I drove 19 hours down here just, just daydreaming the whole time. You're going to get a shot. Draw back. Put it behind his shoulder. It's just foam. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Thank you for coming here. Thank you for making the sacrifices. You, you text Jenny and you tell her, Papa's coming home. Thank you for being here, bro. I love you. I don't even know what's around here. There's crickets and scorpions and rattlesnakes and everything wants to bite you or tear you to pieces. And these beautiful animals live in the middle of this stuff where we're not supposed to be. I can't believe that happened. <laughs> we did it, Allie. Baby, we are on the board. Allie and I got this little thing where we raise the roof, we high five, and we kick ass. <laughs> I touch him yet. I get to touch him the rest of my life. That'll do. Can't believe he did it. He's rad, man. I couldn't have dreamed him up with the chart. He's awesome. This is the best feeling in the world. Attacking the Hypex off the Florida Mountains. What'd you do? <laughs> <laughs> Did it, brother? Uh, came down. Uh, oh, what is that guy? He's back. He's awesome. See what Ibex tastes like. Let's try it out. You're up. <laughs> yeah. We got Ibex green chili tonight. Nice. Mm. It's really good. Buddy. Let's go home. Montana bound. A touch heavier than when we came. Let's roll. Home. Let's see what Miss Allie's up to.